Hello Aries, welcome to my channel. This will be a reading for the week of the 13th of June. Please do bear in mind that these are general readings so it may not resonate for everybody. Take what does and leave what doesn't. And um, please do like, share and subscribe if you like the reading. I would very much appreciate that. So for this week I'll be reading the coffee cup and then I'll, I'll, I'll also be pulling out some cards towards the end. Okay Aries, let's see what we have. Okay, this is all about taking action. I see here you've been planning a lot and, and you've put um, quite a few things into focus where you are ready to take that jump. And um, there is there is something here that you've been kind of... Um, for some, there's been some hesitancy in the past, but po I think because it's it's it looks like you were waiting on some uh, response from another person or or uh, a place or something. But now it's like you're definitely taking a lot of things into your own hands, um, and you you're done with waiting. Is what I'm seeing here. Actions speak louder than words. It's what you know. This is kind of like. The theme hits like your motto for the week. Actions speak louder than words. That is what you are doing. And um, there's been something you've been very thorough about. And what you say you do. Um, and there is on the other side. There is some kind of connection on the other side. Where there is that kind of hope that another person if you're in some kind of situation with another person that you are hoping that they would also take action because you've proven or you're proving to be that kind um, and you're not letting anything get in your way. Um, and there is on the other side that person that um, kind of has been a little bit... Not as forthright as you. Um, and nonetheless, despite that, you, you're still heading on to your direction. You're getting on with things and not wanting to lag behind. Um, I see that is changing. You, it's kind of like you were very supportive of, of another person or whatever situation you were with kind of sacrificing quite a bit and giving time um you were very generous with your time and other things and now it's kind of the focus has been shifted a little bit and um there are it's like there are a lot of things that you have been wanting to get on with which you are now you're very much more in control you're very much in control um of of, of what is happening, of your plans. It's like I see for a lot of you, you could be journaling a lot of things. I'm seeing a lot of journaling. Um, and whatever it is that you're writing down, I'm seeing that you, you're going back to that and seeing how much you've accomplished and what the next steps are to accomplish the other things that you have um, envisioned. Um, and then it's like as you get ahead... Others seem to be following in your footsteps as well. And that could be also in connection to this other person here. Um, there, There is also a situation where I do see somebody uh, missing you, Aries. This isn't necessarily a love reading. This is just what I'm seeing right now, that somebody is missing you. And it does not have to be a romantic connection. It could be a family member, it could be a friend, you know, uh, it could be any other person. Um, but it's like, as they see you going ahead, doing your own thing, really kind of taking action here and succeeding, it's like they realize... Um, just how valuable you actually are. And this is the thing, you're noticing, you're realizing your value, your worth so much here. I'm seeing um, uh, also uh, work, like a past job or a current job that you maybe you've already handed in, you notice they're wanting you to stay even more. It's like that it could be a, a past employer or something could be reaching out as well. 
um, but you're very much kind of uh, in um, in need. Like uh, people want you, people want to want you to work for them. Um, and I'm seeing a lot of leadership here. You're very much, as I like I mentioned, very much in control. It's like you feel like you are in control of your destiny. And it's like you know exactly what's about to come because you have planned this out so well. Um, and it's something here that you have been very informative and, um, you know, because you've been very informative to others, they already know what the consequences um, are to be if you were to walk away from a particular situation. So if you are in kind of, whether it's a relationship or a work relationship, what, whatever kind of relationship this is, you've already kind of given them all what they need to know. And if certain things are not being met, you, you no longer have uh, time or patience for that. I'm seeing um, planning to uh, also travel and experience new things there's adventure coming up also um you're also I, I see her taking a break wanting to take a break as well because it's like a job well done you deserve it you've done a lot of really good things for yourself and for others and now it's like um giving yourself a bit of a me time here which is good to see um and prosperity is really good as well you know you've been this this sharp focus that you have of yourself has really opened up lots of channels here and avenues where prosperity is really good. It's continuous. There's a continuous flow of that, um, and there is harmony in a relationship. Something will be smoothed out, harmonized. Um, there's been healing on both sides, but especially the other side. And also, there's something here with um, a school or for the study. Something that actually makes you very, very happy. Okay, let's see what the cards have for you, Aries. Aries, please, for Aries. Aries. Oh, five of Swords. And the Seven of Swords. I was thinking about the Seven of Swords. How funny. And the Magician. Well... This is great because this is about taking control. This is something that you have basically warned somebody about. You've given them, as I was saying, you know, all everything that they needed to know about you, about the current situation. If you don't see change, you are doing what you need to do. And that is taking action. That is moving along regardless. You, you, you know, there are people left behind here, as you can see. And I do see you kind of having to move, um, leave a situation but look it brings you the magician card it, it you are starting to manifest your desires here because that shift um that focus has has shifted you have you have changed direction you're changing the way you you um go through things you your perspective is changing as well it's like you you know you don't have any time to be going back and forth anymore now it's like you're very much putting your foot down, removing yourself from any kind of conflict and deciding to, you know, really establish for yourself what it is that you want and you're making it happen here. You're absolutely making it happen. You found the resources, you found how and, and you know, where to go and when and everything is very much in your control the wheel of fortune and the seven of wands and because of that destiny you see this is again something to do with your your having a really good grasp of your destiny it's like you're able to see so much further than you could before because you've cleared the way you've cleared the way aries and so it's like, you know, the fortune, your fortune is changing for the better. And, you know, you you here with the seven of wands, kind of like uh, st sticking to what you believe in. This seven of wands, you stick to what you believe in. You stick to uh, continuing along with your vision. 
and you pro you're progressing here as well the seven of wands gives me that um that vision of you progressing as you've had to come out of certain disagreements and whatnot, certain situations, you knew that uh, you did not want to be stuck in. And there is nothing but movement here as well. And I do see that, you know, there is somebody that will be also, you're finally going to see the other uh, side taking action as well. And with the Two of Pentacles, there is... I see balance coming in for you as well. You've been juggling with quite a few different things, personal, you know, with e your um, emotional side, as well as professional side, you know, having to sort of keep appearances up when you go to work, say, for example, or whatever you, you may do, whilst having to um, had your energy being consumed with personal matters. But I do see a shift changing here with the Page of Pentacles. We're getting stability coming in. We're getting, you know, something new coming in that is prosperous for you. And it's very, it's rewarding. Something's very, very promising. You've taken actions and it looks very promising for you. You know, there is a, a, a beautiful turn, on, turn of events here. And it's like those rewards are now starting to come in. So you can flourish here. It's a great new start for you. And I just see that you're really kind of jumping ahead. You're going ahead, but you're, you're going about it the right way. And, um, you know, definitely stick to what your heart and your mind has been calling you to do. It's wonderful, Aries. I hope you enjoyed this, Aries. Thank you so very much for your support, for your donations. I truly do appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. Please do take care of yourselves. Until next time.